I will not wake up from a nap. What time did you fall asleep? 8.30 p.m. two nights ago. She said she was tired, went to bed, and never woke up. How's her breathing? Heavy, but she normally breathes like that when she sleeps. Any unusual behavior patterns? Yes, I feel as if she's been acting strange lately. Well, how so? She's been acting very tired lately, just not like herself. Like she's living inside the shell of her body. When I look her in the eye, it's not Sarah that looks back. It's nothing. Nothing at all. Sarah's your daughter, I assume? Yes. <laughs> Beautiful name. My mother's name is Sarah. I, I just want my daughter back. You'll have to explain in detail what happened before she went to sleep. She's been quieter than usual and has been going to bed early and waking up at sunrise. Then she falls back asleep. Good morning, Mother. Good morning? Sarah, it's 7.30 p.m. Goodness. I must have lost track of time. This is getting ridiculous. Out, out of bed. You have to do your homework. Mother? I don't think I have any homework. Well, when was the last time you went to school? Maybe last week. Sarah, really, I'm going to have to call a doctor soon. But I feel fine. You've been sleeping for 16 hours out of the day. Fine. Let me get you some tea. It'll make you feel better. I don't understand my condition. I don't get what I can do to fix it. Although it is nice to sleep all the time, I don't have to worry about schools or essays or boys or life. I just get to live in my dreams. Isn't that what everybody wants? gigantic meadow. It looked like Provence. Well, I don't know. I've never been to Provence, but it was beautiful. Everyone was dressed all in white. And everyone was mingling together, all happy. The ladies all had flowers in their hair, and everyone was barefoot. It sounds wonderful. It was. Dream life seems to sound better than real life. But it, it, it's not. I would sleep forever if I had dreams like that. Have you had any interesting dreams lately? <laughs> no, not lately. I haven't had any dreams in a long time. Nonsense. Everyone dreams. Well, I don't remember mine. I do remember one I had when I was little. It was a year after my father died. We were playing in the park and suddenly it started to rain. It rained so hard I remember the drops of water hitting me in the face. Father was trying to get me to leave, but I couldn't move. You know when you have those dreams and you can't move? It's like that. Father was trying to get me to leave, and the drops of water were hitting me in the face like small atomic bombs. What happened next? I woke up. I'm sorry. It's a terrible nightmare. You know, it's strange. I don't remember having any dreams after that. Dreams get better, Mother. So does life. Let me get you some more tea. Maybe I don't want to sleep forever. Although, my dreams are always pleasant. And I never have nightmares. Dreams are better than reality. Everyone knows that. Sarah? Sarah, no, wake up! Sarah, no, don't do this to me! 
How peculiar. Never seen a case like this before. It's been two days. She hasn't woken up since. Well, she seems perfectly healthy, just sleeping. I can write you a prescription that hopefully make her less tired. You can pick it up from the pharmacy in a few days after she's woken up. Good luck. <laughs>